Hey, what's going on today, guys? Today I'm going to be unboxing the new MSI RTX 2070, the Duke Edition. Anyway, so uh, to start off, I'll, I'll show you the box. Of course, here's the front, and here's the the top top side, the bottom side. I'll show this. This has some fine print, so I'll, I'll show it up to the screen here. There's a side. And the most important side, of course, is the back. I'll show the fine details. Pretty interesting technology there. Anyway, so yeah, now I'm gonna unbox it. Alright, so first is a little envelope here. It has MSI logo on it, kind of neat. So yeah, on the inside, I'll just open up. You know what's in here. The first is a, a use, user guide. I'll probably, I'll probably never read this. I mean, yeah, it's in probably 10 different languages. You really don't need this for a graphics card. I don't know why they do this. Anyway, that's that. This is kind of interesting. This is a kind of a, a booklet. I'll, I'll just give it a quick read. And, oh, cool! It has like a its own little comic. So I guess this dragon thing is is a MSI mascot. Kind of neat. Shows you how to use in a comic way how to use MSI Afterburn and all that cool stuff. I guess kind of an innovative way to get young people into overclocking their graphics cards. And here's a here's a little thank you note they left. Oh cool, now these look like um, cup, cup uh, I can't think of the name, where you put your cup on top of the table. Cup mat. Uh, I thought this comic was pretty interesting. I mean, you know, they, it's kind of a, a cool way of giving, giving instructions for people probably doing it the first time so they don't feel embarrassed. Alright, so now the part you've all been waiting for, unboxing the card itself. Yeah, right here in the box we have, well first of all the peripherals, there's this cool, um, I guess it's a bracket to prevent sagging because it's such a long card. It feels like it's, I mean, it feels pretty high quality aluminum. It's a nice courtesy of MSI to include that. Uh, 
Now for the card. It's gonna stand up so you can see the screen better. So yeah, here's here's the front of the card. The fans aren't that big. Oh, well, I'm gonna get something for reference. Just, I'm sure all you guys are familiar with. Uh, if I can get this out, okay. Yeah, so I'm sure all you guys are familiar with the 12 millimeter fan. So I'm just gonna hold that up in in size comparison between the the Duke at 2070 and and the 12 millimeter fan right here. So yeah, I'd, I'd say these fans are maybe around, hey, oh, I mean, uh, I was saying 12, I mean 120 millimeter. Yeah, so these fans are probably around 80 millimeter size. So uh, they, yeah, they're definitely on the smaller end. This, this card is rather narrow compared to most. And yeah, they, they do provide the PCI cover right there. Now with these newer cards, the serial number isn't on isn't on a sticker anymore, but rather it's engraved on the unit unit itself right here. But yeah, here's a here's a backplate, pretty high quality. Um, by the way, this card, for any of you wondering, this card has no LEDs. Yeah, right here are the the power it supports. Here are the ports. You know, focus in on that. You can see there's one display port, one HDMI, another display port, and a USB C C connector. So this can comfortably support three monitors. The other side just just simple plastic. The, you can't really feel the heat sink, but it's, oh yeah, you, you can see it here, it's it's pretty, it feels like it's nice solid aluminum heat sink right there. And so yeah, that's the card. Uh, thanks for watching, and uh, hope you guys uh, enjoy, enjoy your PC billing. Thanks, bye.